Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. <laughs> Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be a hairstyle tutorial. It's going to be a tutorial on this $10, $10.99 hairstyle. Like how could you, like how could you not? Like how could you not want to try this out? How could you not want to watch this video and then go to the beauty spy store and buy yourself your own half wig and do this hairstyle? Because it's just so affordable and it's so cute and you're just going to be feeling yourself because I'm feeling myself so I want you to feel yourself too. So... Without further ado, make sure you give this video a big thumbs up and down below. You click that subscribe button and you join the fam because there will be new videos every week from now on. So make sure you're subscribed and your post notifications is turned on. I love you guys and thank you so much for watching and let's get into this video because I am super excited to show you guys how I got this look. So I got my bonnet on, as you guys can see. I um, started this hairstyle last night. Whoo wee a little crazy so let me explain to you guys what I did um, all I did was anyway like I was saying before I was rudely interrupted um, I just sectioned off the front section of my hair because as you guys know we're doing a half wig which means that it's basically like half of a wig it you can you could really pull it up like pretty close to your hairline and just have like very small leave out if you wanted to but i am doing like a half up half down hairstyle so i obviously want more hair pulled out so i just went behind my ear and parted all the way across to the other side um and then i just put the the rest back here is just in a messy nasty bun and i'm going to show you guys um what I did with the flexi rods. I did attempt this hairstyle already with this same half wig. So the clips that I insert of what the half wig looked like straight out of the box, I'm not gonna be in the same uh, <laughs> shirt or whatever. It's gonna be a little confusing because I attempted to film this hairstyle tutorial already and it just didn't go as planned and I wasn't feeling it and I didn't wanna have to use heat for the hairstyle so that's why we're trying it again, part two, but with flexi rods so that this is a heatless hairstyle. Six flexi rods, these are the gray flexi rods purchased these at my local beauty supply store a very long time ago. I don't know how much they cost, but they're not that expensive. You get like a pack of like maybe like 10 or 12. My hair was um, washed and then I slicked it back into a bun. So I used a little bit of Eco Styler gel and pulled it back into a bun. And I wore it like that for the day and then I took it out of the bun and just brushed it out. So it was kind of like stretched hair, stretched natural hair, no heat on it. Just brushed out curls and then I just twisted it up in the flexi rods. So now I'm just going to part my hair in the back, the back section. I'm going to part it in two and just do two cornrows going down so that I can put the half wig on. Okay, so I braided both halves that I parted on. So I have two cornrows going down. And I'm just going to tuck them kind of like this and just bobby pin them in place. Okay, so I'm gonna show you guys what I did to get my little flexi rods to look like this. It's very, very, very simple, like super, super easy. I literally did it in about five minutes. Granted, it's only six flexi rods, but it's just so simple, like anyone can do it. In order to achieve my flexi rod curls, I um, brushed out the hair so it was nice and flat. I took my flexi rod and I pulled it all the way to the end of my sectioned off piece and I'm going underneath my hair. I'm not going on top, I'm going underneath. Pull it all the way to the end 
I'm gonna grab the end and I'm gonna roll the hair up making sure that the hair stays flat. I don't wanna roll it like in a spiral or like if it's bunched together cause then I'll get more of like a spiral curl um, and that's just not the kind of curl I'm going for. So I'm rolling it flat, 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 all the way up really tight. And then I just bend one side in and I bent the other. And that's how I got my curl. So I'm gonna go ahead, I'm gonna just leave that like that and we're gonna apply our half wig. So this is the half wig that I'll be applying today. It has some really pretty um, curls in it. The texture of it is kind of like that kinky straight. It's like, I think it's called Dominican blowout or Dominican straight. So it's like if you blew out your curly hair or your kinky hair and then put like a nice curl in it. I did wear it once already, so she's getting a little bit frizzy and a little bit knotty, but I feel like it makes it look more natural than when it's like straight out of the package because the curls straight out of the package and I will insert some clips are very tight um, and they're very coily and it also makes the hair look smaller so it looks kind of fake in a way so I was brushing out the curls when I did first wear this and now that I've worn it once already I feel like it looks even better and it's really long, the hair. Honestly, uh, I would prefer if it was a little bit shorter because I feel like it would look more natural if it was a little bit shorter. It does come with two combs, one at the top and one at the bottom, like the nape of the neck. So I'm gonna go ahead and slide those in and then I'm going to bobby pin the sides of the half wig down just because I feel like it gives me a little bit more security. Push this in at the top. Pull it down over my braids and push it in at the bottom. Okay. Ooh, it looks so cute. It looks so cute already. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> you guys don't understand. Like the first time I attempted to film this cute little tutorial, I was struggling because I've never um, used a half wig in this texture before. So it's like you, I had to manipulate my own hair and I thought putting heat on it would make it look cute. And honey, that was not cute. So take a bobby pin and I'm just pulling the side, like I'm literally just pulling the half wig forward and bobby pin it into place. <laughs> so cute, oh my God. It's actually really cute. So I'm gonna go ahead and just take down the flexi rods to see what I'm working with. You guys already saw this curl. Some of these curls are questionable. It's okay though. We can make it do what it do. Let me, I'm gonna go ahead and just separate some of the curls. I'm gonna take this brush. I got this from Sally Beauty. I actually really like it. It's a hard bristle brush, but it's like super narrow. And then it has a pointed end on the other side. I'm just going to lightly, lightly brush these curls up. I'm gonna put it in a ponytail. Ooh, that's real cute, girl. It's cute. I'm gonna take some of the hair from the wig, just a small piece, and I'm gonna wrap it around the ponytail holder just to disguise it. Okay, so the last thing I would do is obviously these edges, baby girl. So, I got my little edge brush, a little edges. These two are bomb. Like, I feel like I've been using these and these only um, ever since my braider, Chanassa, put me on. Shout out to Chanassa. She told me about um, this Shine and Jam 
conditioning gel extra hold so I really like this to do like slick back styles and then the style factor edge booster in the coconut mmm not only does it smell good but it has extra extra hold like I just be on swim baby <laughs> like, on swim. so I'm gonna take the yellow the shining whatever and I just ooh, I applied too much right there and I just apply this to slick things down big girl and you don't have to do too much cuz your hair was in the flexi rod so it's nice and soft and bouncy and then I'm gonna take the edge booster and I'm gonna do my Little, ooh, little That's actually sick! Oh my god! Wow, I actually did that and then some. <laughs> Period. Oh my god, I think that's the end of my video. Period. <laughs> no, this is actually. Stop. Stop playing with your girl. Like, honestly, stop playing with me. Like, y'all be sleep on me. Like, stop playing with me, girl. You going back to school, and I know you need the back to school hairstyles, you know, the affordable ones. Because not everybody out here got money for frontals, you know? Not everybody got money for fucking bundles and a closure like sometimes you just need to be rocking like a little beauty supply store hair and that's okay baby girl you can look cute as fuck okay i got you Alrighty, so this is the completed hair style of look let me show you guys the beak the beak super cute the only thing I probably would have done differently is just take a couple more of the pieces from the wig and add it to the ponytail so that it can kind of like be falling with my my hair but I still feel like it looks cute either way like I'm honestly like so in love with it oh my god I kind of did that I'm glad that I refilmed this tutorial because the first time it was a hot ass mess and this half wig was ten dollars like legit like oh my god i think it was like 10 it was between 10 and 15 dollars but i'm pretty sure this was the 10 because i ordered three half wigs and i'm pretty sure this was the 10 dollar one but either way between 10 and 15 dollars that is a steal that is affordable so you can look cute on a budget i got you sis i got you i got you so if you enjoyed today's hair tutorial, then make sure you leave a comment down below. I'd love to write back to you guys. You can also go ahead and give this video a big thumbs up as well. Click that subscribe button and join the fam. Turn on your post notifications. And don't forget, you are smart, you are beautiful, and people love you. I love you guys, and I'll see you in my next upload. Bye.